of a massive fire that destroyed an apartment building and injured a firefighter in Birmingham's Lakeview District last Thursday has now been ruled arson. We brought you that breaking news earlier today and tonight CBS 42's Corey McGinnis is live in Lakeview and Corey this news has other business owners in the area pretty concerned. Yeah, Jack, good uh, evening. They actually really are. Now, officials tell us that they got their hands on surveillance video from the area here uh, in Lakeview, but those local business owners, again, are on high alert. I was shocked because Gym was owner Joseph shocked. King is feeling a bit tense following the Lakeview apartment fire that we now know is set intentionally. I hope it's not just someone going and setting fires. King has been working in the Lakeview district for three and a half years around the corner from the apartment complex and says he believes it was an isolated incident. It's taken so long for this apartment complex to be built, it's way behind schedule. These are the flames that destroyed the apartment building, injuring a firefighter in the line of duty. He's doing fine and he is recovering. In a press conference Wednesday, ATF says they've gathered enough information to determine that it was an incendiary fire caused by an arsonist. They say experts ruled out every accidental cause that could have started the blaze. Everything is on the table right now. Uh, the DA's office, as well as the United States Attorney's office, has been involved, and, and we have had attorneys monitoring briefings every day. So the, we have the whole gamut of federal, potential federal and potential state charges to look at. Meantime, this business owner is keeping a close eye on his business and leaves this message for whoever is responsible for the crime. I think it's ridiculous that you're going to put yourself out there to do something like this. It's going to affect the whole community. And police say if you have any information regarding this uh, case, you are encouraged to uh, give them a call. There is a $5,000 reward. We're live in Birmingham. Corey McGinnis, CBS 42 News, local coverage. You can count on.